One of the most common delivery mistakes that speakers make is stepping on thoughts and laughs. Here's how it happens. You have an interesting statement that is provocative. It's going to create reflection or it's going to create an emotional connection with the audience. So you make that statement and then you just keep on talking. What you need to understand is the audience is thinking about what you just said. Even if they don't say anything, even if they don't raise their hand to ask a question, they're still thinking about it and you need to give them that time to think about it. If you ask them a question, even if it's a rhetorical question, you have to give them time to answer in their mind. So if I say, have you ever been to Sausalito? Well, I have, and I love the little downtown area that's right near the water. And you can overlook the bay and see San Francisco. Well, that's the story that I want to tell. But if I don't give you a chance to think about whether you've ever been to Sausalito or not, I've just stepped on your thought. Stepping on laughs is also a bad mistake. Some speakers are humorous. You might be very humorous. But don't make the mistake of making a humorous statement and not allowing your audience to laugh. They want to laugh. They want to enjoy themselves. So give them that chance. Just pause. Once the laughter subsides, then you can move on. And in that way, you'll create a greater connection with your audience.